we are going to talk about protein phosphorylation. Phosphorylation refers to the addition of a phosphate group on a molecule, which is a crucial chemical reaction, especially important for protein function as this modification activates. Protein phosphorylation is the most common and important molecular mechanism of acute and reversible regulation of protein function. Through protein phosphorylation, protein function is regulated in response to extracellular stimuli both inside and outside the cell. Due to a large number of kinases and phosphatases in the genome, the identification of the specific enzymes responsible for a given site in a given protein is immensely challenging. However, because protein kinases and phosphatases recognize local specificity determinants within proteins, it is possible to use small peptides to study the characteristics of site-specific phosphorylation. Most proteins are found to be phosphorylated at serin or threonine residues, and many proteins involved in signal transduction are also phosphorylated at tyrosine residues. Lots of protein kinases exhibit a strict specificity for phosphorylation of either serin, threonine or tyrosine residues. Protein phosphorylation is involved in regulation of a broad spectrum of cellular processes and states. Several signaling pathways critically involved in embryonic development and the modulation of gene expression are initiated from the activation of cell surface growth factor receptors that are known receptor tyrosine kinases such as insulin growth factor 1 receptor, fibroblast growth factor receptor, receptor serin threonine kinases BMPR and kinases TGF beta R upon ligand binding. These receptor kinases are fully activated and phosphorylate downstream, intracellular kinases to initiate phosphorylation signaling cascades. Induced phosphorylation activates cytoplasmic protein kinases, such as RF, the activators of the mitogen activated protein kinases ERK1, 2 and MEK1, 2, belonging to the RS, RF, MEK, ERK signaling pathway and the PI3K kinase, a KT protein kinase. The phosphorylation signaling cascades also frequently regulate the translocation and activity of several transcription factors, such as MYC and SMAD158 and SMAD23 proteins. These signal transduction pathways are highly interactive with each other and influenced by other protein phosphatases including PTEN and PTPN that negatively control protein phosphorylation and also play critical roles in the modulation of the signaling network and the cell biology. Although phosphorylation signaling will affect the expression of differentiation related genes in nucleus. Protein phosphorylation has an important role in essentially all aspects of cell biology. It is characterized by the addition of phosphate donated from ATP and the removal of phosphate from a phosphorylated protein substrate, catalyzed by protein kinase and phosphatase PP enzymes respectively. This pervasive post-translational modification serves as molecular switch mechanism, modulating diverse protein functions including enzymatic activity, protein turnover, interactions, Confirmation, localization, and crosstalk with other PTMS, which in turn regulate broad cellular biological functions. Kinases and their substrates form vast networks of dynamic protein phosphorylation within cells. These networks facilitate the transmission, processing, and storage of cellular information, allowing cells to rapidly respond to their environment. Protein rephosphorylation also plays a vital role in the regulation of protein function. Reversible phosphorylation of proteins during the cell cycle is a key regulatory mechanism of cytoskeleton organization, dynamics, as well as in cell differentiation and division. Do you want to know more about protein phosphorylation? Do not hesitate to contact us for any questions. Email us at info at creative-diagnostics.com or search our website. Thank you.